So now let's take a little dive into the technology. First, let's compare the dispersion characteristics of a traditional speaker to a line array or a beam steering source. This single driver source emits sound in all directions equally, covering the audience plane along with all other surfaces in the space. Because the sound is spread over a wide area, it quickly loses energy over distance, as well as causing reverberation. A typical point source loudspeaker focuses the treble energy from the cabinet front into the room. However, due to the long wavelengths of bass sound waves relative to the cabinet length, the low frequency will act omnidirectionally. When we place a series of transducers in a line, each of their circular wavefronts meet and interact, and they create a sound wave that propagates forwards in a more linear manner, thereby enabling us to focus this energy and aim it where it's needed. As the length of this array increases, we get the added benefit of this behavior extending down further into the mid-range and the base frequencies as well. With CBT, we allow the middle pair of drivers to fire first and then use a passive delay network so that the next pair fire after and so on and so on. By doing this, we can focus the energy into a tighter beam, which will give us a narrower opening angle. We can even adjust the delay and level to point that beam down into the audience. And if we do this correctly, we maximize the power directed at the listener and minimize the amount of sound bouncing off the rear wall too. In order to avoid sound from reaching certain reflective surfaces, we can use Intellivox to create a very narrow beam of sound that can aim directly at the listener and not the room around them. Because we focus the energy very tightly, we also lose less power over distance. Consequently, Intellivox can cover a large area from a single loudspeaker.